You want to comment on that, Murray? Well, it's, 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 like, it's like anybody that's got a gasoline engine and puts the additive in to give it more zip. And that's basically what you're doing with the Everglow. You're, you're giving that animal a chance from a natural standpoint to go to work, to go to work and put into the body what the body can actually use, not something <laughs> synthetic that the body can't use. When these units enter into the bloodstream, almost immediately this horse will start getting more oxygen into the system because there's more iron in the bloodstream and as this iron passes through the lungs the horse will start to breathe more and there will be more oxygen going into the into the inner 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 flesh of the horse so what that means is that if you have a sick horse this horse will detoxify and heal that much quicker we also have a unique uh, situation as far as the enzymes go that we put in here the enzymes are basically extracted from growing barley now barley as we know is a natural product one of the big products one of the big problems that we have with a lot of enzymes in the marketplace is that they are derived from mold or fungus compounds and when you start feeding these to horses as single stomach animals, I don't know of an animal other than a chicken besides a horse that is more sensitive to mold than a horse. So when you start feeding, when you start feeding this stuff, what, what you're going to run into when you feed the synthetic enzymes, you're, you're actually going to get a reaction on this horse similar to a, to a mold intoxication. With our product, we have over 25 different known enzymes that we've identified in this, in this extract. And of course, the other thing that we do that is so unique is that we take the roots along with it to get the extract out of the roots. And when we look at the roots, when you think of a seed putting it in the ground, it has to have an immune system. It has to fight off viruses, nematodes, bacteria, fungus, uh, you name it, they're all there. Uh, <clears throat> and when you have this ability to fight this off, one of the unique things about this, about this product is that we, we found initially when I was looking at how I could market this product, um, we know that within 24 hours, barley, barley uh, oh, oh. enzyme extracts will start fermentation like crazy. I'm just here to see what uh, Ivanhoe has to say. When I feed my horses, I always try to have them fed where they look nice and nice hair coating. But when I, it was about 10 days after I started feeding the Everglow, I could really tell a difference. My yearling stallion that I had, he started getting up on his hind legs and tearing around in his box stall. He had never done that before. And also had a, bought a weanling perching colt at Harley's sale. And he was weaned a little early and he was real sluggish. But I could tell a big difference after I started feeding it. So it's working for me. I, that's all I have to say. Thank you, Ivan, and I know you've told me this about your uh, two-year-old Morgan horse that you've been uh, uh, leased out a trainer's got him, the horse is looking. He's been grand champion, Morgan Stallion, and how many different shows? Just one. Just reserved one. For a reserved for a couple. And so you had a Morgan Stallion out there that's been grand champion, has been reserved. The competition is tough in the Morgan business. And he's got him at a trainer that does everything right to a T. And he sends a jug of Everglow down to him. And the trainer tells him back, he says he had seen a huge difference. Now I'd say when you get a superb product, but why would he see such a huge difference if that horse was healthy, looking good, and all that? You want to comment on that, Murray? Well, it's, 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 like, it's like anybody that's got a gasoline engine and puts the additive in to give it more zip. And that's basically what you're doing with the Everglow. You're, you're giving that animal a chance from a natural standpoint to go to work, to go to work and put into the body what the body can actually use. Not something synthetic. <laughs>